Hey guys, good morning. Happy Saturday. It is 10 08 a.m. I already took a shower. Um, I was vlogging, I started vlogging yesterday, maybe like around 12 midday, I think. Um, and then I never finished. I just started the vlog, never finished because it just was not feeling good. Um, that time of the month and it's just it was insane uh so i kind of just laid in bed for the majority of the day all the afternoon till babe came home um she got me something and she forgot it at work and she goes you know what we have to get it today because she won't be going in she wasn't gonna work today um so she wanted to go back and get it just to make sure that you know it didn't get lost or anything so we went back and she wanted to have five guys she wanted that sounds so hilarious she wanted to um <laughs> have burgers from five guys uh and i've been wanting that so i was like okay that's fine um and then we went to ross she just kind of wanted to get me out of the house just because i was feeling like not the best and we went to ross and I need to show you guys what, what we got. I can't do a closet chronicles right now, closet haul, because um, I finally, I'm also doing laundry today. I started it yesterday. <laughs> we did one load, though. Um, and I had I left the clothes separated. But one thing I can show you guys, it's right here, is a rug. Ooh, ooh, a really furry, like, uh, black rug. Because I want to put it in this area where that pink one is, because the pink one is now... Filthy. And also, I have my eye appointment today at Lens Crafter. I think it's like at 4.30, 4.40. So, I wanted to get ready, but I think I wore makeup last time I went. But then I also don't want to. But I don't want to be barefaced. I guess I could do my eyebrows and kind of just do like a light makeup. I think I'll do that. Um, also, yesterday, my Shein order came in. I got an Amazon order. Our bed sheets came in. So it was it was an eventful, another eventful mail day. I'm going to change the bed sheets as well since we got the new ones. And we also got some at Ross. I don't know where Babe put this stuff from Ross. Oh, it's over there. We got like a mattress cover, some bed sheets. And I got some clothes. And let me show you guys like let me show you what babe brought me okay let me preface by saying this that she has a friend that works at starbucks now so lucky us lucky me lucky her um and i had been wanting this cup so bad since i saw it Okay, Coffee Chronicles. It's the black uh, matte tumbler that came out with the Valentine's Day collection. Guys, do not pay $60 for this cup. People reselling it are crazy. Because I had seen a post on Instagram that they're going to, it's going to be a core cup. Which I didn't know what that meant, so I went to look it up and all that. And basically, it means that if it's a core cup, it's going to be restocked at least this whole year. Um, and I was like, oh my gosh. Like, I might have another chance. So from the Valentine's Day collection, the cups, that was the one that I really, truly wanted. And then Babe, when Babe went to look for it, she found this one. And she bought me this one because she couldn't find the black one. But I love this one. I have this one that's ombre and the one she got me that's like like orange into pink. But this one, you guys don't understand how happy I am. I am obsessed with Starbucks tumblers. I know. I have a collection. I haven't showed you guys because I don't want to be judged. But I just love the cups. So, you know, everyone collects whatever they want to each their own. I collect cups and makeup. <laughs> so my happiness yesterday was like <laughs> I was happy but in pain <laughs> but I was like 
that definitely makes up for being in paint. Like, look at how beautiful it is. Like, it is way prettier in person. And I know it's just black, but I love it. It's my favorite color. <sighs> um, Babe got me an 85 coffee yesterday, and it was so freaking good. She says she doesn't like it anymore because it's too strong. She's used to the Starbucks coffee. Honestly, me being honest, like, me going to get a Starbucks coffee is, like, super rare i get a strawberry acai with lemonade or i'll do like a caramel frat but that i used to do like ages ago i haven't gotten one of those in ages so my favorite iced coffee like if i go out and buy it is 85 which is a bakery or duncan and i know a lot of people don't like duncan but i personally do babe doesn't really like duncan uh the iced coffee i do and then like I prefer my iced coffee at home than getting a Starbucks iced coffee. Which I still drink like the Starbucks iced coffee. It's the one that I buy. The little nitro cans. And with the with the nitro creamer. Which yesterday I checked on the phone. When we were coming back from Ross. We were passing by that Walmart marketplace. Where um, it says they have the creamer. I checked and I looked it up to see if they had some in stock. It said they did. We went in. And they didn't. I was so salty. <laughs> I was like, no. But they were restocking the whole store. So I was like, what if they're going to restock it? So we asked someone. They went to check in the bag. They said they didn't see any. So I was like, oh, cur. <laughs> Rude. Um, but yeah. Anyways, the other day I mentioned that I was going to show you guys this little... Uh, the little glittery signs that my cousin got me. So I found a perfect spot for it. So right here with my crystals. Um, in case you guys are wondering, my favorite crystal is an amethyst. And it's because it's my birthstone. Um, but this one, these are the ones my cousin gave me. This one, I actually bought it. Uh, it's to cleanse the rest of my stones. And then, so she got me that one. And they were $1.99 at the dollar store. It says gorgeous and then there's another one up there it says fabulous i didn't hang that one yet because it just it like fit perfectly right there um but this one is definitely my favorite the gold one obviously so just want to show you guys that those little signs in case you guys want some they're at the dollar store bella come here hi hi <laughs> Say hello to the party people, babe. What's up, party people? <laughs> hey, guys. I was sharing my cup. My amazing cup. <laughs> that babe got me. <laughs> With her new Starbucks friend. Yeah. <laughs> hey, guys. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back. A lot of hours later, um, kind of got ready, did my hair, well, straightened my hair. Um, I, did, <laughs> I did a little bit of makeup just because I didn't want to look too nothing. <laughs> Babe, straightened her hair. It's a cambio. <laughs> just kidding. Um, we're gonna put gas, Babe's gonna put gas right now. And then we're off to my appointment. I'm excited because I want, I know the glasses I want already. And Babe's glasses are ready. So this is the before with her old glasses. <laughs> and then in a while, you guys will see her new glasses. So I don't think mine will be ready today. Um, hers were done a lot quicker though. Then, no, they were, yeah, they were done before time in a week, and they had told her two weeks. Um, she didn't go pick them up because we were gonna go this weekend for my appointment. But the thing is, oh, it doesn't have that noise. Hey guys, we're out of the mall, the mall, the lunch crafter. The appointment actually went well, I just had to wait two weeks for my glasses. Um, I changed the style I was going for because. I, I was thinking about it. I wanted the aviator style glasses, but I don't know if you guys can tell when I wear my glasses, my lazy eye, uh, the lens is super thick. So I was going to get that aviator style, which is super thin, like the frame of it, huh? 
it's just like literally super thin and I was like it's not gonna look good because the lens is super thick my prescription didn't change which the doctor said that is perfect that it hasn't changed in two years um, she just made slight slight modifications and babe is looking fabulosa in her new glasses <laughs> I like babes new glasses they look good a different style than she's had it's kind of similar to all of her other styles like the the bottom part is um kind of clear so, oh sorry <laughs> <laughs> um so we came to guess where my favorite store <laughs> target but we have to do like a quick in and out just need to buy some woman things and we ordered applebee's we're gonna treat ourselves today and we're gonna do pickup because it's too cold to have outdoor dining dining even though here in california they're um opening everything back up for outdoor dining but i still want to eat at home and then we got a treat, our dessert at the mall from, what is a place called? Mountain something? They have really good. I was going to say Rocky Road. <laughs> Chocolate covered. Rocky Mountain. Rocky Mountain. I said Mountain something. Well, let's go to Target. Okay, guys. So I changed the setting on the camera again. I know I've been talking about the little noise the camera makes. And I can't hear it. It's not on manual focus. It focuses on my face super quick. You're I think you're good on this side oh um and yeah i was just telling babe that this is possibly actually i believe that for to be a fact that this is the quickest trip really people <laughs> this is the quickest trip to target ever ever and it's the least amount of money spent ever as well so it's like a in and out type of situation <laughs> um my eyes were blind to everything <laughs> they were blind to the accessories the makeup the clothing <laughs> everything because <laughs> she was hungry no i am hungry uh and the food should be ready now which is perfect got some mozzarella sticks some spinach and artichoke dip babe got what are they riblets the riblet plate i got the the rack of ribs i'm so excited and if this fixed itself already i've been struggling for nothing <laughs> for nothing so we're finally on our way home it is 6 13 I know I didn't vlog much in the day, but it was more just like we were doing laundry and just chilling and the casa. I will show you guys later on in the closet <laughs> <laughs> the haul from yesterday at Ross because it wouldn't be a vlog apparently without a haul. Um, but it was nice to have Babe home off on a Saturday. Who is she? <laughs> oh we showered Bella because sheesh she needed it she looks so scruffy but now that we showered her she just looks like a little poof ball that just went <laughs> poof <laughs> like Dib's ready to dig in oh you can see your glasses much better here my plate my drinky my five they're right there. <laughs> the. We ate yours in the carpet. Right. <laughs> Babe got a real blood. You want a fork? For him. So we're gonna enjoy the food now. Babe is enjoying her apple. We got, what is it again? Almond? Good almond? Mm hmm. And it was Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory. I'm going to eat my chocolate covered strawberry. Pass me the bag. I got a chocolate covered strawberry. That looks so out. 
Yum. We're watching Chicago PD. And then my apple's in there. Babe looking fabulous with her glasses. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, let me know how the quality of this um, setting is. I feel like it focuses, but it takes longer. But I also don't hear the noise, so just let me know. Because <laughs> I've been stressing with the noise and the quality and the focusing on my face or like focusing on something else. We've been watching Chicago PD, like Marta calls it, flow is in town. picked up a bag of peanut m ms These are my favorite. And some Sour Punch Bites. These are so good. And I want to make some enchilados. And then just girl things. You know? <sighs> good morning, guys. Baba? Good morning, guys. <laughs> <laughs> we are... What time is it, babe? Put your glasses on. It's <laughs> 9.57. 9.57? We are getting up and getting ready to go get a donut. Because I am craving a tiger. I was say tiger claw. <laughs> tiger tail from that donut place we went to the other day. That we showed you guys on the vlog. And... We're probably going to have taco bowls tonight. We That's on the menu. Because my mom's making caldo de res. And don't judge me, but I don't really like it. <laughs> um, so that's what we're going to do. And we're going to go get some hangers for my clothing. Babe, are you going to get hangers still? Or are we going to take the coats out? We're gonna take the we're gonna declutter the closet, take the coats out and put them in the tubs, one of the tubs we have here, so we can make more space. And and yeah, babe is ready. Uh, I am decluttering, clearing out my socks. So I did pick up two other packs. So this is probably my third pack of socks. No, this week, yes. This week. <laughs> no, it's my fifth. <laughs> <laughs> Remember these are from Kohl's? And then there's a there's a pack I saw over there in my in my cajon where my socks go. There's a pack and I think that one was from I can't even remember. And then the SpongeBob ones. So I need to take out all the old socks and then these two. But these are really nice. I love the color on this one. And then black and white basic. And then um Babe found this when we were at Ross. It's a Serta Rest. Very cool. <laughs> Very cool. That sounds funny. Four piece sheet set. set. And it's. Um, Very cool because we get hot when we sleep. Yeah. It's the uh, um, Cal King, which is so hard to find everywhere. We had been struggling. And this set was only $39.99, which for Cal King um, bed sheets, that's a really good price. Because the other one that we got, we really like this one too. This is the one we originally had. Um, and the one we went to pick up from Kohl's, but we had to order it. The Columbia. So this is a quick, this is quick from uh, Kohl's. I had to order it online. And I think this one, that's the price it was. Unless it was like a little cheaper, $169.99. We got a nude color. The color we had on the bed right now, the, what we have, is gray. Because... That's the only color they had when we picked it up. Let me see. I'm trying to change the color. Oh, there. It looked, it looked a little too warm. Yeah. Um, so, we got the nude shade, and I love it. And we have a black one now. And then Babe also found this Beautyrest Ultimate Protection Mattress Pad. Because we want to change out the one we have. Cal King. And it was only, I think this one was $29.99. Yeah, 30 bucks. So, like less than the price of the Columbia bed sheets, we got the bed sheets and the mattress pad, which honestly is really good. I also picked up some little hair accessories. 
I think if I cover my face, it'll focus on the product. I hope. Black and red. And then I found this really cute organizer for palettes. I don't necessarily want it for palettes, but I did want an organizer like this. And it is from Ross, actually. That's how that works. And then it was only $9.99. And Babe got for her new lunch pail <laughs> uh, some, what are these called, Babe? Trastes. <laughs> I'm having a brain fart. Tupperware, whatever it's called. <laughs> Food storage. So it has three different sizes. And then I found the cutest shirt in the world. It's a Spongebob tee and it is. I really like the uh, tie-dye in this, how it's like really dark. And then it goes from different shades of light blue to like a periwinkle and like a lilac at the bottom. Love it. And then I got a cardigan little. This is at my at-home outfit. <laughs> Anyways, that's what we're doing today. I'm seeing that I need to check my other battery see if it's charged because you guys are gonna go with us on today's adventure just sunday sunday chill day today <clears throat> Look, is this perfect for your lunch? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. I said yes. Oh, that's cute. Oh, it's no, you're fine. I still haven't found a salad bowl. Man. Let me see. But you can't get the ones that are like that because then you have to carry them so it defeats the purpose. Oh my gosh, they have them. They have them. Oh, it has an ice wall. So you're going to be a collector of lunch pails now? Mm -hmm. yes. they have them. That's a cappuccino one. Oh, what about this one? Well, this one's just one. That's perfect. Just think about myself. No. I'm just kidding. ¿Cómo crees que solo pienso en mí? Babe, what happened at Marshall's? <clears throat> Nothing. I didn't have anything. It was a bust. I am looking for hangers, but I decided to buy specific colored hangers, black velvet hangers with a rose gold, um, what is it, hook? And they didn't have them. So, um, all my hangers are exactly the same. I am not about to get different color. And it looked weird. Because no. And they also don't have Babe's plastic boring hangers. <laughs> I told her they don't make those anymore. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so we're heading over to the other side to go to... TJ Maxx. I think it's the TJ Maxx Home Goods. The Slay and Diva. Ow. Oh. 
Don't be basic. <gasps> uh, why do you show me things, babe? <laughs> that I want. Oh, look at this one. Cute. Girls night out ugly. <laughs> <laughs> Mini boss. I like that one a lot. Ooh, stay home. Oh, I like that one a lot. Where would you go? Don't know. No more space. Do it with... <laughs> don't give me ideas. I don't think you need to give me those ideas. <laughs> More issues than Vogue. Oh, look at how cute. For a baby. Relax, rinse, and repeat. What is this? Do I have lashes? Here you go, throw there. Yeah, so cute. Oh, Seriously, though. Because adulting is hard. We have a little creeper. Creeper, creeper, creeper. I think we're ready, babe. <gasps> I did not see that. Oh my gosh, look at that. That one is so cute. Oh yeah. From far away, I saw bikini never hurt anybody. <laughs> she read bikini never hurt anybody. <laughs> she was not wearing a bathing suit, babe. It was um, it was a bodysuit. That's what the bodysuits look like—a bathing suit, but it's a bodysuit. Oh, this reminds me of Marta's Bambina. This is cute. Yes. Babe. Pero donde lo voy a poner? Hey, party people. <laughs> Babe's trying to see uh, her ulner. Ulnerd? Wow, <laughs> Arnold Palmer that she wants to get from Starbees. So, TJ Maxx was a bust because we didn't even get off because the line was long and I was not going to stand in line for hangers. So we ended up going to Burlington and it was also a bust because I didn't find the hangers. But, just got hangers for Bay because she has like three hangers of the velvet ones but they're gray like with the silver hook. So I told her... I'll just use those while I find the rose gold ones. And since she's going to like declutter the jackets from her closet, my clothes will fit there too. <laughs> uh, I already have half of my side. You are lying. Your sweaters and your coats. Two sweaters and one coat. My clothes is going to go there. So we're going to get some drinks. And then, Babe's like, you don't feel like you want a snack? <laughs> you feel like a snack? <laughs> <laughs> like, okay, I want some uh, Cheeto Esquites from La Michoacana. Because zero is too far right now. Because it's feeling like a very chill blah day. 
I just want to go home. <laughs> Guys. Baby. <laughs> I got that. Get into this goodness. It's hot Cheetos. Esquite. Then all the fixins too. The esquite. And babe. I wish she would look at me like she looks at the Cheetos. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> That looks so good though. And then I got some hot Cheetos with cheese because I was craving those. Where's your drink? Oh, yes. Well, let's eat because that looks so delicious. We only got a few things at Burlington because I told you guys that we didn't end up going to Ross. By the way, the Cheetos Esquites were so good. I needed another little hair towel. Uh, these are the ones I like to use. When I get out of the shower, it's just more convenient. And it was only $3.99. I had one from Marshall's, but since we didn't find the hangers and we didn't find anything else, I was like, okay, let's just go. I'll just look for it somewhere else. Burlington, they had them. It was $3.99, and it's perfect for the hair. We did get the gray velvet hangers for Babe. Um, I'm going to use them while I find the black and rose gold ones because they didn't have them at Ross the other day. They didn't have them at Burlington. They didn't have them at Marshall's. We were going to go to TJ Maxx, but the line was just too crazy to wait in line. So I was like, no, let's just take these for you. She does want to eventually change out all her clothes to the gray velvet hangers. Oh, when I tell you guys, I was so excited when I found this. I can't even explain to you my happiness. So, okay, yeah, they're tie dye sweats. But, but, they are Spongebob. So freaking cute. This They say Spongebob on the side as well. I, I, I screamed a little when I saw them. Hey guys, we are now in the kitchen for the first time <laughs> ever actually cooking. So, I mean, I do cook. I am going to cut the lechuza lettuce for our taco bowls um let me see i'm gonna put it down the middle so i made the meat already the meat is ready i cooked it uh flour tortillas come out like i just put them in a oven safe uh bowl and i just kind of do the shape and they come out very crispy and <clears throat> Um, I have a few more cooking. I also have, I made babe, well, I cut up some mango, cut her up some orange, packed her for lunch. Tomorrow is Monday, so, you know, starting the week. And I wanted to cut today so that she could have a taco bowl for lunch tomorrow because it's usually like um which is very filling and it there's always a lot of leftovers even if i um cook a little it's just because it's really filling and i feel like it goes a long way that's what i'm trying to say <laughs> so cutting up my lettuce i love cutting the lettuce i don't like anybody else but my mom cut the lettuce because my mom has always cut the lettuce so, so thin and fine that when, when I was younger, she would always cut the lettuce for all the parties, for the salads, for the pozole, the repollo as well, um, cabbage. And that was one thing I always said, like, I need to learn how to cut the lettuce like my mom. I don't do it exactly, I feel like. Uh, she says I do it pretty good, but... Um, I feel like over time I'll get to that point where I feel like it's exactly like hers. But definitely I would say from the house it's her who cuts the best lettuce. And then I can say I'm close next. Yeah, I'm close after her. Um, I still feel like I need a little bit more to go because I still have to go over some pieces. But my mom will be like, like fine, perfect, everything. So I'm going to get there one day. <laughs> I, this is so random. Like, why are we talking about lettuce? But we're in the kitchen, so it counts. Um, 
either I or her will cut the lettuce because it, that's an important detail to her and she's very picky about her lettuce as well. I mean, she cuts it that perfect. I feel like she has <laughs> the right to be picky about her lettuce. My favorite spot <laughs> um the food was so good i just finished washing the dishes packing babe's lunch packing up the leftovers so i could wash all the pots and pans and uh, today i just felt i think exhausted from the headache it just kind of drained me i had to take two tylenol because i was just not like it wasn't going away and right now i like turn and my my neck cracked and babe goes oh, that's what you needed <laughs> i was like yeah probably so oh, i have my clothes folded right here um on top of the tubs i just have to fix it in the drawers but i also have the shein box right here on this side and it's just a hot mess that i need to put everything away and i'm gonna i'm probably gonna do that right now watching some youtube and pick up the closet a little bit for tomorrow and then go edit and probably call it a night because i'm tired you want to say good night to the party people <laughs> good night party people <laughs> babe in her spongebob shirt she's representing this relationship <laughs> where we wear spongebob attire <laughs> yes uh how's your day babe Good. How was dinner? Delicious. <laughs> uh, I was gonna call it a night already. So yeah. it's the first day you're making like guest appearance for closing of a vlog. What? <laughs> <laughs> I cannot. Anyways, we will see you guys. Well, I will see you guys in the next vlog. Babe might or might not make a guest appearance. <laughs> Maybe. Wow, get out of here. <laughs> See you guys in the next one.